everyone, happy Feast of the Transfiguration. Um, today, obviously, we, we celebrate that. Um, a little background, all three synoptic gospels tell the story of the Transfiguration. Matthew, Mark, and Luke, with remarkable agreement, all three place the, evident, the event shortly after Peter's confession of faith that Jesus is the Messiah and Jesus' first predi prediction of his passion and death. After Jesus performs a series of miracles and foretells his own death, Jesus leads just three of his disciples, Peter, James, and John, to a high mountain. This is where the transfiguration takes place, in which his appearance was radiantly transformed. It's kind of funny that we're, we're celebrating transfiguration today and kind of our choice on, on heaven, because to me, that was always kind of a glimmer of heaven. But good morning! I think Caroline's joining us this morning. Sorry, I was kind of giving a brief summary on the transfiguration. I know it starts and then I'm like talking and you guys join. Um, doo -doo -doo. That was weird. Good morning. It's new and fun things. Good morning. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to figure this out. New Something new here. I know. It was like, it was like, would like to connect to other devices. I'm like, what are you doing? How are you? I'm good. I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Sorry, let me... Do you want to go ahead and share our intentions? Or do you want me to? Um, I'll, I'll do it. I have them right here. Okay, perfect. Okay. Uh, from Therese, prayers of Thanksgiving. Our main intention was to find a house. We close on our new house this morning, Friday. Oh, that's exciting. God is great. Um, from Patricia, please pray for me and my children, for God to lead us on the path that he has in mind for us, and for God to bless me with a job so I can bless my children and others. Yeah, prayers, prayers for, for a great job for you. And then we want to pray for Jenna from Blessed Is She, as she's pregnant in the hospital, and she's pregnant with her sixth baby, a little girl. A little girl, yeah. Yeah, sure. praying for all of them. All right. Do you have anything, Caroline, you'd like to pray for? Um, maybe just, um, uh, it seems like all my kids are, you know, we're starting a new, we're starting grad school, we're starting a teaching job, we're starting football after we broke our leg in half. So yeah, yeah. So just for all new beginnings and, um, for protection, uh, for all our children. Yes, 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 exactly. <laughs> all right, well, we'll just go ahead and get started. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and on the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From whence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. For our Holy Father and his intentions, we pray. Hail Mary, full of, or our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase in the virtue of faith, hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase in the virtue of hope, we pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase in the virtue of charity, we pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus. Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, 
Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The first sorrowful mystery is the agony in the garden, and the fruit of the mystery is forgiveness. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but, let, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The second sor sorrowful mystery is the scourging at the pillar, and we pray for purity of heart. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning with thorns, and we pray for moral courage. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fourth uh, sorrowful mystery is the carrying of the cross, and we pray for an increase in patience. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fifth uh, sorrowful mystery is the crucifixion, and we pray for perseverance. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus. Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy. Hail, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, the eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, by your only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. How are you? How are good. You? Good. They're good. They're really good. So. You're actually at home today. I am. I'm. I'm uh, in Florida. So <laughs> this is. I think. I think this is the fifth. Uh, fifth location of the summer. So um, yes. I think we're we're going to be set now as we're uh, getting ready for school to start. Yeah. When did this? So. When do they start down there? Um, they start on Wednesday. So okay. and then um, my number two starts like the first week in September grad school and then Matthew starts in September sometimes so okay. I lose I lose track of what's yeah. going on I was I um, found it interesting because a lot of them had started here like in the Indianapolis area like the past week you know Gwyneth starts next week but I just it's like I can't believe it I can't believe it's August I'm just like, I wow. know it, it went quickly our book study went so fast too I can't believe we're on I know. the ninth the ninth meditation already it's, it's, wow. Yes. Yeah. All right. So do you want me to ask the first question? Well, I was gonna, if, if, um, and I don't know, this might be review or maybe it might be boring, but okay, I did ahead. not, I did not know anything about guardian angels. Oh, I, yes. Share I don't. It. So I, um, and I, I've told people before I'm a convert. So I have, I hear people talking about guardian angels. I hear them saying, if I fall asleep during my rosary, my guardian angel finishes it. But I didn't know everybody had one. Mm -hmm. I, and I have never taught my kids about it, anything. So I, when we did this meditation, I did some research um, a little bit about it. So I was going to share a little bit for some people that may not, yes. may not know what it's about. Um, which is really funny because um, just kind of a step back, you know how everybody has like their little pet peeves of their, you know, in their yes. mind. And one of mine always, since I've been younger is when people say that people become angels, which we oh. know people don't become angels. Like angels are separate yes. celestial beings. <laughs> so I know when my dad passed away, I mean, this has been like a pet peeve my whole life. And my, when my dad passed away, so many people said, Oh, well now you have an angel in heaven. Now you have a guardian angel. And I'm like, no, I just have a dad up there. <laughs> so it's funny that when this whole guardian angel thing, I was like, wait, what is this about? So anyway, I did a little bit of research, um, mm -hmm. which, um, so let's see, let me see what it says. Okay. According to the catechism of the Catholic church, from the moment of conception until a person's last breath, a guardian angel surrounds each human being with their watchful care and intercession. And their feast day, the, a guardian angel feast day is October 2nd. And then, of course, 
the Protestant in me said, okay, where does it say that in the Bible? Of course. Oh, okay. that's, yes, go. That's, yes. Yeah. Yes. So it, it says that the church's belief in guardian angels is based on Jesus's teaching in St. Matthew, where it says, see that you do not despise one of these little ones. For I say to you that their angels in heaven always look upon the face of my heavenly father. Um, and I found it interesting that in the Bible, only three angels were met, mentioned by name, which yes. Gabriel, Michael, and Raphael, right. Um, otherwise known as part of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> <laughs> I always think that I'm always like, oh, wow. Um, so, um, and then the word angel comes from the Greek meaning messenger. And so basically these angels can bring you messages from God. Um, and then it also said, um, let's see, uh, St. Thomas Aquinas, St. Francis of Sissy, and Padre Pio had special interest in guardian angels. Yes. And um, this is also interesting. I didn't know that. It said, according to the catechism and Catholic doctrine, one can also invoke and pray to the guardian angels of others. Mm hmm so anyway, I just like, so you're telling me I have a guardian angel. I just don't know I have one. Is oh, that it? Of course. Oh yeah. You all have one. Everyone does. And priests will have multiple. There will be dice. I, yes. I could go on and on talking about my guardian angel and others. I think actually um, I, I was fortunate in that to me, that was always just normal. <laughs> like, I thought everybody knew this. So I'm so thankful you kind of shared. Um, Padre Peo, like he taught me because when I was younger, I read a lot with him and um, he really shared that insight in praying to like praying, asking for help for someone else's guardian angel, especially like a coworker or someone I'm struggling with. Like <laughs> I would be like to my guardian, can you please go talk, <laughs> go talk to them? Like so that and, and, and you would be amazed. Always invoke your guardian angel. They're there to help you all day long. Um, and I, 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 yes, I just, um, mine has always been my, always, always, always has been there. I want to say best friend, but like, um, yes, I love how Bridget said, I think my guardian angel every night. I wish I was better about that. Like we're, I'm always running around praying the prayer, but you know, just to, oh, they were married. Oh, that's amazing. So, um, and then, there's just have been so many profound things. There's like the congregation of angels. Uh, there's nine choirs of angels. Um, I mean, my, my, when you can't attend, you send your guardian. Yeah. My guardian angel has always been profound in making sure I get to mass or reminding me about reminding prayers. And I don't, I don't know how the communication or, or the, the, the gentle, knowledge or <laughs> but um yes yeah i just thought i just didn't um i just didn't know that so i did some research and another thing i found one more thing and then we can get to the book it said um it although it may be nice to think of that when someone we love dies they become an angel and as such return to be by our side, this isn't so. Our guardian angel cannot be anyone we have known in life, nor a member of our family who has died. It has always existed, and it is a spiritual presence generated directly by God for you. Mm -hmm. so, so is it too late? Can I get to know my guardian angel? Oh, of course. Okay. Yes, they're always there. Always. I'm like, always for 50 years, I've just ignored, ignored them. They probably are like, wow, what's wrong with this girl? Like, <laughs> No, not at all. Not at all. I, um, have you ever seen that image of the guardian angel going like this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, that one always makes me laugh because sometimes I think you might just do it. It's like, what are you oh doing? Oh, my gosh. But oh no, gosh. never, ever. Yes. It's okay. Never. Well, that's good to know. I don't know. Maybe I'm the only one that, the only Catholic for 25 years that hasn't actually thought of that or known oh, that. Um, so I, I, hopefully that was helpful for. Um, I think it was super helpful. And I think a lot of people appreciate that. Um, yeah. I, Yes, yes, I always, especially my children's guardian angels, I'll be like, please, please help them get home safe, you know, um, so, That's you awesome. know the guardian angel prayer, right? Well, angel no. God, my guardian dear, to whom God's love commits you here, ever this day, be at my side, to light, to guard, to rule, to guide. Um, 
I guess I voice yes. So that that's the guardian. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, I saw that. I wrote that down, but I was like, oh okay. my gosh, I've got to, I got to get that one. I got to learn that. Yes. Um, okay. So, um, wow, this was a, this was a pretty cool meditation. Actually. I like this one a lot. Yes, I did too. Yeah. Um, so we just had a bunch of, there's a lot of questions here. We probably can't get through all of these. Did any of these, I kind of went over the guardian angel part, but um, one question and it says, and I always hear people say this, especially people that have lost loved ones where they say the closest place to heaven that they feel closest to the people that they lost is in the mass or in adoration. And so how is, there was a question in here, how is the mass an encounter with heaven. Mm -hmm. um, well, for me, so I just didn't, I don't know, in my journey to me, heaven is union with God and giving him his rightful praise. So everything to me is glory to God. Um, and to me, that's ultimately achieved here on earth in, in, in the mass. Um, and you're participating in Calvary. So, I mean, and that just to me is always that constant meditation of God's goodness, holiness, selflessness. And that to me is always in that reflection and adoration of the cross and him on the cross. So, I, yes, to me, <laughs> that's that's heaven um, because we're always striving for that union, you know. So everything's union and communion with – I thought the meditation – I'm sorry, I'm jumping all over the place, but um, the the meditation, like uh, that election and that kind of, uh, that Father Johnny, he, he kind of, he laid out here. I thought it was so beautiful. Um, it started on Lord of All Creation, like page 121 in mm -hmm. that vision. And, um, I don't, and to me, that's just like, yes. <laughs> I don't want to read it all, but um, I, I, how is mass an encounter for you with heaven? Well, I mean, I guess I've always thought of it like, um, because God is truly present in the mass or at ad mm -hmm. adoration that he's there, right. then that's heaven because he's in heaven. So if he's there on the altar, yes, there he yes. is. So that's why you can feel the closest. Um, it's, and it's funny, I've heard people, especially people that, um, that go through a lot of grief, um, mm -hmm. or are, are dealing with grief, a loss of a loved one that they always say that, um, it's kind of, it's a little trite, but it is kind of, it is really applicable. They say that you can't like store up the grace that God gives you for when something bad's going to happen. Like it's not like a train ticket that you can buy and then you can keep it until you need it. Like he gives you the grace when you need it. And when you're mm -hmm. really grieving or when you're really suffering or when somebody that you love is suffering that you will feel, you may feel closer to God at that point. Um, and that you're going to get the grace that you need yes. at that point. And I know when my dad was sick and when we were really, it was hard. Um, when I was at mass, I felt closer to God even more so. And I don't know if those were just, if it's his presence there or the grace. So I, to me, anytime you're in the mass, you know, mm -hmm. because you're focused and you're, and you're concentrating and you're really, you know, trying to recognize what he did on the cross for you and right. for every single person. And that I, one thing that kind of blew my mind, it was, I think it was on page 122. It says, um, and you discover he still bears the marks of his crucifixion. Mm -hmm. Like you kind of think like, okay, he rose and everything's happy. And, <laughs> but that he still has those marks because we're all still sinners. Yes. I was kind of like, Oh, geez. Yeah. Poor God. Jeez. <laughs> it's so beautiful. And uh, I also, I also like where he said, um, because obviously if you were actually sitting somewhere and you were able to see both heaven and both hell, the way he described it, mm -hmm. like it's a pretty obvious choice. Right. 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 But I thought his excellent point of, do we align our lives with that choice? Right. And I feel like that's where I mess up all the time. <laughs> 
do you put yourself in a position that you can really see the difference or does everything become blurred? Right? I, yes. Yeah. And right. I think, yes, that's, that's a, that's a great point. Mm -hmm. um, and even, you know, examples of even in social media, right? Like social media can be really powerful and useful and helpful, but it also can be very dangerous and detrimental. And those, you know, those lines can become blurred. And then you're like, wow, what is, what are we all arguing about? Or what, right. what is, how is this giving glory to God? This is not, this is, this is the work of the devil. Like he's excited mm -hmm. that we're all arguing about these things. So, yes, exactly. Um, I love that. I love that yeah. point. Cause I think, you know how you'll say eyes on heaven or is right. this giving glory to God? If we can even just take that split second to ask that, or recognize that you immediately go back to, to kind of what our ultimate goal is. <laughs> right. My problem is sometimes I don't uh, have that split second. That's where you can exactly. ask an angel to remind you. <laughs> exactly. I'm going to do that today. Um, so do you, do you mind, like, do you have an experience with your guardian angel, like a tangible experience that you could share that would like, Ah, I mean, no, I mean, it's always in like small little instances, I feel like of protection or a car coming or <laughs> um, for me, it has been, uh, this is going to sound silly, but um, kind of my clock or my, I know that my guardian angel will wake me up if I have to um, get up for adoration at 3 a.m. or, um, which sounds crazy, but that's, that, those are my tangible reminders or, um, the, the silent whisper of, of pray for someone. Um, I don't know, but th those, I guess not concretely. And I'll think about it after this and then I'll be like, oh yeah, I should have told him about oh, yeah. this. <laughs> no, no, I mean, I put you on the spot. I like, um, what Jen, Jen said here, it says, if we face our sin now, I just want to wait and ask for help. Now the choice will be easier later. Oh, that's really good. Like, you know, yeah. don't. Yeah. Um, wow. That's really cool. Um, let's see. Uh, where did, where did you see those? Let me see where it's. Have you had any? These are a lot of questions here. Um, I love it. It says, what got, tools do God and the church give us to make the right choice between heaven and hell? What tools? Well, to me, that's the sacraments. Sacraments, right. Um, yeah. So, and, and I think that's like, you know, why Catholic? I'm always like, well, the sacraments, silly. <laughs> and people right. probably be like, what do you, and, and, when you like for me, like I've I've wavered or I've you know, especially in like my early twenties, I was struggling and and far I felt far from God, and um, in those participation like in that participation going of returning to the sacraments and to prayer like it was like night and day, um, and and to me that as far as like setting your path right in the clarity, I always think of the so. Um, right. I'm sorry. I totally went off track again. I'm like, hmm. oh no, that's. Um, but I feel like the sacraments, yes, like those graces, and and to me, they help give you the strength a lot of times. And I mean, we still, I still fall all the time, but I feel like right. Those are the right. biggest tools. Not, and I mean, even looking into church history and the saints and the martyrs and like they're in our angels and. There's just like a whole repertoire of tools um, right. in our, our yeah. community and people. Yeah. What did somebody say here? Let me see. I'm going back. Um, oh. Oh, here we go. What did this say? On page 120, the imagery of kneeling in a field to pray, looking up to see the throne of God with the entire heavenly host. Um, right. And I also really... I know this, but it's always really good to hear it again, is how, um, how you matter to God, like you yeah. matter to God and that he longs for each of us and, and 
like it, it said, you're a jewel of God's creation. Um, and you're not lost in a sea of a million people. You're a singularly precious jewel of God's creation, a jewel made to shine uniquely with the glory of God. Can we so, staple that on everyone? Because I, right. I think until you realize that and how much, because we'll say God loves you, but until they actually sincerely receive that personal longing of love from God and recognizing it, it's tough. I don't, and, and I don't know how, I mean, like, to me, it's a grace when actually someone actually receives that or hears it. It's on page 124. But yeah. like, I, I, like, I see that with my kids sometimes, like, um, I don't know, growing up, we don't they sit down and explain it to them well enough, or I don't remember anyone explaining it to me that God loves you. You know, because to me, I felt like one in a, a 10 billion people. I'm like, he doesn't right. have time for me. Um, right. Like my, my problems are too small or my worries of my heart are so minuscule compared to, you know, the suffering mm -hmm. of others. But that, that in fact, um, which we always say, right, if you want to have a, a best friend or if you want to have a good relationship mm -hmm. with your parents or your kids, it's a relationship and you go to them and it's personal and God's there for you always. And when you realize that he really intimately cares about you uniquely, I think it really opens up your ability to, to really want to be in heaven. Yes. You know, yes. and from, you know, and that's the one thing I think I've learned the most um, a lot through many Hail Marys is just the idea that, really the meaning of life is really going to heaven right? and becoming a saint. And, and, and so how can we do that and keep your eyes, you know, I, I know we keep always saying that what Kara Clark said, but right. Keep your feet on earth doing God's work and your head in heaven. Yes. Yes. And I'm, so I, right. I, I think um, when I, so I realized in, in my journey, um, how limited I had placed, or I had placed limitations on God, thinking that he, he didn't have time for me. And once I started contemplating his glory and how the, the benevolence, the, the magnificence and good, all good, um, I realized that I had no idea, I had no capacity to understand his infiniteness. And, right. and then um, I, I have loved you with an everlasting love. I think it's in Jeremy. Is that Jeremy? It, it, anyways, somehow that scripture like popped out at me. Um, and, and I realized that, yes, yes, God, God loves each and every one of us with a, yes, a longing that we, I, I feel like we can't completely understand, but if we try to at least comprehend and accept it, and right. receive it, um, it, it will change their hearts instantly. And so right. this, that, that was just beautiful. I feel like we should, should post it somewhere. <laughs> yeah, it well, we'll, we'll post, post that somewhere. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Um, yeah. So next week, Father Johnny has been so gracious that he is going to join us again to help oh, us awesome. to wrap up everything or any other questions that we might have. Um, but, um, oh, here's the book. Some people are asking. I don't know if you can see that. It's oh, lift, um, up your heart. lift Up Your Heart by Johnny Burns. And, um, yeah, it's, it's been really, really awesome because I think um, this, the introduction to the devout life, is that's hard to read. I mean, that's heavy stuff. And so I'm like, yes. I always like the, the easier versions of things. I'm like, can we have the, sometimes, sometimes Jill and Kristen sends, send me books and I'm like, oh my Lord, like I have to read one page a day. And then I'm like, oh boy, I'm like. <laughs> oh, this is a lot. Um, I'm and so it, sorry. I no, I, like, I'm like, oh, this book is fantastic. And they're like, it's 900 pages in <laughs> font size eight. And I don't know what the half of the words mean, but thank you. Um, so um, somebody said, we'll, um, we keep every Friday on Instagram. Yeah, we'll put all the IGTVs in a, a separate, uh, mm -hmm. we'll put it so everybody can access and everybody, a lot of people don't know this, but we do have a YouTube channel. And every day we save, um, we save all the, the rosaries and the discussions. So people can, um, 
you can share them with people that don't necessarily use Instagram. Right. So I have a couple, two housekeeping things, or maybe three actually, um, some things that are coming up and okay. that we could use the help from the community. So um, we are going to do in April, again, we're going to do our international month, just like we did. Um, and we would love to do 30 different countries than we did before. Um, that might be tough. Ooh. So if anybody has, if anybody's from another country or say they're stationed there, they're living abroad or, um, or you, you know somebody, they pass those names through the DM. Um, we are also thinking about, and if I say it, now we're going to probably have to do it, but uh -oh. um, we're thinking about doing maybe a matchmaking week <laughs> in February, over, over um, February 14th week. So okay. we'll probably I'm need to. I'm signing up my, my son and my daughter. <laughs> Everyone's <laughs> like, oh, I'm signing up everyone. So we've had, <laughs> yeah, we've always said, we've always said we wanted to do that. We, so we think we will maybe do something fun with that in, in March and, or in, um, in February. And then um, I would love, 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 especially now that we've seen how many of the Olympic athletes are Catholic and wearing miraculous medals and doing the sign of the cross. There's a lot of Catholic um, Olympic athletes and we would really love to in March do an Olympics week if we could get some of these athletes to pray with us, but it's hard. It's hard because they're so busy and it's hard to contact. So if anybody lives where an athlete does knows they go to your parish, they went to school with your kids, um, just send the information over. So we're going to try to do that. To mix okay. it up. We have, and, and, and Mary has sent us so many beautiful guests. I mean, we have, mm -hmm. we are full all the way through January of 2022. AJ wants it's to a, join too. Okay. <laughs> all right. I wrote her down February 14th. Be ready. <laughs> um, but anyway, yeah. So those are some things um, just coming up and then um, awesome. yeah. And just, so we're so thankful and grateful for, this community and everyone mm -hmm. and for God who's blessed us with these guests that are like every day, you know, you don't need these big thick books, Jill. I just going to listen to our guests. I know. I know. Some, at some point I would love, love to like what William said to get the, the excerpt, like, like do the reels because from all the guests, like oh, there be have amazing. been so many and you know, cause I think that, is a lot easier to pass along to someone who's kind of, you know, like, I'm not sure. Right. Then, you know, when we pass along a 45 minute video, they're like, well, I don't have time. <laughs> right. Like, exactly. It would, yeah, it would be, it would be amazing if we could have our editing and um, yeah. promotion promotions department uh, <laughs> edit those videos every day and put up a, a real um, get, I, no, there are, that would be really awesome to go back to some guests because there's ones that stand out like what Kara said or father William saying mm -hmm. about the hour of our death or father Eric saying, pray for best friends or, mm -hmm. uh, uh, when Brad said, you know, most of anxiety is managing your blessings. Those okay. little, those little nuggets who I think actually that came from Christophonic. Cause I think I gave it credit to Brad, but I, then he said, no, I think that's, <laughs> um, Oh, father, can we get father Nathan again? You mean um, the nomadic monk? Wait, is that Nomadic Monk? I don't know. I don't know. They're all so amazing. They are so amazing. So, so amazing. amazing. And my so. name recognition is not always the best. Oh, oh yeah. Best. Jim Wahlberg. Yeah. The whole Jim Wahlberg and Mother Teresa story. That was truly amazing. Yeah. Um, but yeah, if you have ideas for guests, please send them either to manyhillmarys at gmail.com or DM. And it's always helpful, especially if it's your parish priest or somebody you know or a nun, to let them know we're contacting them because I'm sure they get a lot of, they get a lot of stuff. So, but yeah, everyone's, um, and it's the community. Every time everybody, every guest after they're, they're like, these intentions are so beautiful and this is such a faithful, you know, community. So mm -hmm. yes. it's been really fun. Yes, it's been amazing. Awesome. All right. Well, have a great weekend, everybody. Thank you. Yes. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.